Time now for an update from Fox Carolina News and Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rates certified most accurate. Good morning, everyone. Time now for your news and weather morning update from Fox Carolina. We're following breaking news out of Greenville County. That's where we're in contact with the coroner and the sheriff's office to learn more about a busy scene overnight. This is a look as our crews arrive to Meckelvie Road. That just happened uh, just before 10 o'clock last night. The coroner says that they were called to a car crash, which is where they also found a person with a gunshot. There are still a lot of unanswered questions right now, but the coroner was able to confirm that one person passed away. Right now, we're working to learn that person's name and more on what happened. We'll, of course, be sure to update you both on air and online throughout the morning. Fox Carolina is the school station and Greenville County Schools have just announced its latest plan for ticket allocations for this year's graduation ceremonies. Now, the district says that depending on which school year uh, student is graduating from, they will be given four, six or eight guest tickets. Those guests will be seated in pods or groups to help keep everyone separated. Anyone who recently tested positive for COVID-19 will not be allowed to attend. The ceremonies will take place from June 1st to the 4th at Bon Secours Wellness Arena. We have a breakdown of ticket allocations on our website at foxcarolina.com. Time now to get a quick check on that weather with meteorologist Nicole Pepe. Margaret and a couple passing clouds are out there now, but we're not expecting any wet weather throughout the day today. In the upstate, it starts in the 40s, gets to 70 at noon with a high of 75 degrees. The breeze will pick up a bit, but it should feel beautiful outside. North Carolina starting in the lower 40s. You get close to 70 this afternoon with sun and clouds. It's going to be a great day today to be outdoors. The breeze may blow around some pollen, though, so make sure that you take your allergy precautions before you get outside and we have some bigger changes ahead. While today will be warm and sunny with some passing clouds, we have a major drop in temperature coming by Thursday morning. We could be close to freezing once again. So there could be some frost and freeze concerns going forward this week. I'll have more on the morning news. You can watch from 4:30 to 9 and again at 10. You can also watch our 4, 5 and 6 o'clock newscasts. Get more at 10 and 11 plus in our news app and online.